Smells wonderful. It'll be lovely and moist. Smells wonderful. It'll be lovely and moist. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely wonderful. Welcome to the show that grants you an exclusive behind the scenes look at some of Sydney's top fine dining restaurants to find out what really happens inside an authentic chef's kitchen. Now for those of you who like your TV chefs happy and well adjusted, I must warn you, for the next five minutes you will be witness to the real deal. Episode number one starts right behind me. The Bathers Pavilion at Balmoral is a much loved Sydney icon. Its elegance, breathtaking location and view, and its highly acclaimed and top notch French style cuisine all go to make this one of Sydney's most sought after restaurants. However, there is a part that very few get to see, the kitchen run with the iron fist of head chef Simon Bestley. But just who is Simon Bestley? Simon's one of the best chefs I've ever worked with. He's very passionate. I'm always learning stuff off him. I never ask him a question and he never doesn't give me a don't know answer, which I really like. Ready to lock and load? Oui, chef. Self-motivation, self-preservation. Oui, chef. Um, he, he is pretty offensive. Like, I've, I've never heard some things like, I, I've never, I mean, I've, I'm, maybe I'm a bit sheltered. You know, you're singing along and suddenly before you know it, the girl's got two fingers up your butt. And you're like, hold the phone. What's going on here? Those days are gone. Heard some, heard some pretty shocking stuff come out of his mouth. Nothing like a hot chick sticking two fingers up your bum. You really got it. Sometimes some people need a kick in the ass. Some people just need encouragement. Some people need to be shouted at. And that's his job and he does it very, very well. Give me a little fillet like that again, man. I'm just sticking in your ass, mate. That's mate. It's like being a... Being a chef is having a lot of passion for what you do, and when you're doing it under stress, it's it's just trouble waiting for heaven almost. <laughs> Saturday night is the, the money night of the week. We've got 115 books tonight. We've got eight people on the waiting list. Once service starts, the friendship is finished. This is a big job to be done. It's like a little war. It's important that they know that nothing slips nothing slips by under any circumstances. The order: one oyster, one asiat, one crab, one soup. To follow two venison barra, please. The order: asiat, capoletto, green salad. To follow two barra mundi and a snapper, please. The order: asiat, scallop. To follow two barra mundi. Two barra mundi, one cod and lamb. Oh, yes, chef. The, the friendship and the camaraderie is pretty big in the kitchen. Um, you spend so much time together, you have really no choice but to get along. Most of, most of us here are pretty well natured. I don't think anyone's really nasty underneath. Maybe, maybe Simon. <laughs> No, no, he's not, he's, he's not that bad. He's not that bad. Every head chef has to have a bit of mental state in them, you know, has to be a bit psycho. 